to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about adding and subtracting mixed numbers. And these are fairly basic problems because each of them will have common denom denominators. So let's go ahead and add. Notice that we have common denominators of 11, so we don't need to find um, one. It's already provided. So all we need to do is add. What I like to do, and I'm going to use this sheet of paper because that's too small of a space right there, is I like to place them uh, in this format where they are vertical because I think it's a little bit easier to see. So what you should do is always start with the fraction first. So I have 5 plus, excuse me, 4 plus 5 is 9, and then the denominator remains the same, 9 elevenths, and then 7 plus 7 is 14, okay? And I cannot simplify any further. So that is 14 and 9 elevenths, okay? Let's work another example right here. I'm going to rewrite. We have 8 and 2 ninths plus 9 and 1 ninths. Okay, now all we do is add them together. Start with the fractions. 2 plus 1 is 3 over 9. And then 8 plus 9 is 17. Now I can reduce 3 ninths because 3 will go into 3 and 3 will go into ninths. So that will equal 17 and 1 third. Okay, and I'll go ahead and box that. Okay. And now let's look at a subtraction, okay? So let me move this around so it's not so confusing. And we'll do one subtraction, okay? So now let's rewrite it in vertical form. 6 and 3 fifths minus 1 and 4 fifths. And we're subtracting. We start with the fractions. But you can see I have a problem. I can't subtract 3 minus 4. So I need to borrow 1 from this 6. So I'm going to borrow 1. The 6 becomes a 5. And then what you do is you're going to add the 1 to 3 fifths. And I can rewrite the 1 by using the denominator of the fraction that needs to borrow and place it over itself. So because 5 over 5 is 1. I now add these. 3 plus 5 is 8 fifths. Um, and then we still have four-fifths. So I'm just going to move four-fifths over here so it's not quite as messy. Okay. And now I just subtract. Eight minus four is four. And the denominator remains the same. Five and five. So that will become the five. And then I subtract five minus one. And that becomes a four. And this is simplified because five is a prime number. And we can't do anything else with the four. So, there we go. It is 4 and 4 fifths. I hope that helps with adding and subtracting mixed numbers. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.